tutorial we will be taking apart and reassembling the Landland 2x2. Now this can be tricky to take apart, so here's here we go. So you'll see a screw in there and it is adjustable and you're going to want to unscrew it. Like that, should come off. And this top layer should come off. Now it's a bit dusty and then this rest of, the rest of it just comes off. And there we go. Okay, now, there are these caps over these, but they're very hard to um, pry off. So, you might not even want to take them off, you know. But if you can possibly get one of them off on the side with the screw, that will make it a little bit easier. And to keep the inner layer in alignment, they attach this corner to the rest of the core. And you can take these off if you need to do some tensioning, but that's optional. Now, for the reassembly, we're going to do it just like a 3x3. Three Take an edge, put it in, and remember we gotta make sure this is solved. Put the corner in, put this in, and now do it on this side as well. Remember to make sure it's solved. This one now, and you might want to rotate the mechanism over, but make sure, but be careful and make sure it's not on um, a side that's going to keep the inner layer in alignment, and the inner layer will move with it. So, like that. Okay, that shouldn't be too hard. This last part might be a bit tricky. So what we're going to be doing is we need a very weakly screwed in, but not so weak that the screw comes back out. So just put it in and. Make sure it still stays in there so we can still so that it won't come out. Now put the edge in. Corner. Careful not to lose all the pieces. Now put the edge in like this. And put that in. Put the other edge. Now this next part is gonna be tricky. Put the corner in on one side. And also, it might be a little easier if there's a big, if the opening right there, you know, to, like, get it on. So, we need to put that in, and now we got to, um, put this corner in, so shove it in. Alright, now, um, sometimes the edge will not be all the way down. So, you may need to poke your screwdriver in there to do that, but now you need to put this down and make sure it's not too loose and not too tight. Now, oh, that's a little tight. And there we go, we have done it. This concludes the tutorial.